Yes, so I'd like to uh, introduce and thank Lieutenant Uribe, who's Calipatria's AAPIO, and also Sergeant Duarte, the Armory Sergeant at Calipat, who have helped me deliver these great gifts. My name is Heather Duarte. I'm the Community Resource Manager at Calipatria State Prison. So the staff at Cal was lucky enough to partner with Women Haven and do Adopt a Family, where we have 11 families represented, and different departments uh, are different facilities, administration departments. They each were assigned um, a family, and they have provided gifts for the for Christmas season. I mean, the items range from clothing to electronics. I believe we had a 17-year-old female request an iPad for school. There's an iPad in there for her. So we took the, the wish lists very seriously and attempted to meet everything to fill their, their wants and wishes. I believe it, it I mean, Cal, Calipatria State Prison is a family all in of itself. And so it's just an extension of our family and you could tell that everybody takes a lot of pride into it and wants to make sure that their fa the family they're sponsoring feels that Calipatria love. So it was it's really nice and we actually uh, made a Santa's Village and had every family represented so the different so staff could go in and see it and then we did a picture in front of our Christmas tree just you know before we brought it just so everyone can have that have that memory. Due to COVID, we wanted to make sure that we were as safe as possible. So all items were delivered to us unwrapped. Um, what we did is every item was disinfected and then we placed them in plastic bags and labeled them so that the families will know who they belong to. We also took moving boxes just to stay festive and within the season and wrapped those as presents. So although we couldn't wrap everything, we took made you know our best effort to just embody the Christmas spirit. So I would like to thank uh, the staff at Women Haven for allowing us to partner with them. I'd like to thank Calipatria State Prison staff just for embracing this and doing a great job. And just wish everybody a Merry Christmas and thank you from Calipatria State Prison. Good morning, uh, my name is Efren Uribe. I'm currently the AAPIO at Calipatria State Prison. This is an opportunity for us at the institution to share, uh, like Ms. Duarte said, a little bit of love from Calipatria to, uh, with the community. And also it allows the, the staff at Calipatria State Prison to participate in this. And a lot of the times we don't get to come out into the community until we're out from work. And uh, this is an opportunity for us to engage with the community and give something back. The staff at the prison always look forward to this uh, this moment in the year, and they're always reaching out to us, you know, to adopt a family or when we're going to get this started because they embrace it and they enjoy it, and we just give a little bit back to the community. So one of the things that th this brings to the institution is a lot of the the staff at the, at Calipatria uh, look at the families, and and obviously always looking at the kids, looking at the mothers that that need something during these times. Uh, it it brings them in. It brings them in and gives them joy. It gives, gives them a good sense of doing something good to be able to help that family that needs something. The kids always bring uh, staff in. It's always a big help. Unfortunately, this year we weren't able to do what we normally do where the staff come out here. That's probably the biggest, um, the biggest joy that they get. But they, they come out here, they get to see the kids, they get to see the mom, they get to build the bikes, uh, and they get to see the people that need these items right now. So that's we understand that that's something that the community needs and you know they're happy to give something to them. I would encourage anybody out there in the community that if they need any type of services with Women's Havens to reach out and, and, and ask for that help. That's what they're there for and we appreciate you guys being out there.